So, um, as it turns out, the uh, spot that got me stuck last time, right here, um, they removed it from the map last time I checked during one of the night ride videos. But for some reason it's now back, and I feel like that's them challenging me to try again. I don't, I, I don't know for sure, but uh, you yeah, know, we'll, uh, we'll see. So, so yeah, you can see um, it's right here. The planned route is to go past through there, but uh, obviously there's cones right there, and that's the, that's like the middle of the drive-through. So. can't do that <laughs> oh man come on uh, all right I've been bamboozled once again so that's one way to solve things Good afternoon, Joel. this car is all yours with no one up front your seatbelt is fastened. For any questions, press the help button to speak with a rider support agent. Also thought I'd point out that the you can see the brake pedal moving, but you can't see the gas pedal moving. Um, uh, some riders I've taken along with me have guessed that's been uh, that it's digital or like controlled elsewhere. So.
just changed the destination. Oh, uh, well, I tried to. It says uh, I failed to update my trip. I'm gonna keep trying. trying to update the trip and hold on to the camera at the same time. It's not really easy. Soon is soon. Dang it. It seems to the app is having problems, so I'm gonna ask rider support if they can uh, fix it. Connecting to rider support. Please wait.
connected to quality assurance. Hi, this is David with Limo Rider Support. How can I help you? Hi, David. Uh, my app is having trouble updating the destination. It says it has a problem connecting to the server. So I was wondering if you might be able to change my destination for me. Okay, give me one second here. Can okay. If I put you on a brief hold for a minute. Sure. All right, not a problem. One moment. Thanks for waiting. So, unfortunately, I wouldn't be able to update the address over on our side. Uh, that's just for your own protection. Okay. Uh, I do see the drop off point currently as a go to East Loboya Drive. Is that correct? Yeah, that's right. Okay, is that the address that you wanted to change to, or is that the current address? Uh, that's the, the current address. Is I have that marked as, I don't know if you can see my marking, but that says Tempe Waymo spot. That's, like, that's just a good place to go in Tempe with Waymo, so. But, uh, uh yeah. Yeah, it, unfortunately, I don't see that over on our side. Uh, and when you tried that, has it been giving you the issue for a couple minutes now, or did you just try it and it gave you an issue here? Yeah, I'm going to tap the... Let's see, 3318. So if I tap the edit button and then go 3318 South Terrace Road, and then I hit done, you see it'll updating, and then uh, it says failed to update trip. So, yeah. Okay. okay. Bear with me for one more moment. Let me go ahead and escalate this for you. I'm going to put you on another hold for about one minute, okay? Okay, it's not really a big deal in the in the grand scheme of things, but I, yeah, all right, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, we just want to make sure that you're able to update the uh, address in case that you know anything should happen. So I just want to take care of this for you. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. All right, no problem. Give me one more minute. I'll be right back. Okay, okay. Well, just to help troubleshoot, uh, was that the phone giving you the server issue, or was it the app itself? Um, I have the app open on, I have two phones, I have this phone uh, recording, and then this phone with the Waymo app, and then I have a full full bars on cell signal here, and it, it's updating the map live, so I don't know if you can see the screen, okay. but yeah, so it looks like this is okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, are you, are you able to, have you tried closing the app and reopening it? I, I believe I have, but I'll give it one more go here just for you. Uh, for sure. There we go. So I reopened here. 3318 South Terrace Road, Tempe. Done. Okay, it's updating trip. Yeah, still failed. Yeah. Okay, thank you for doing that for me. Give me one second. Sure. And 
was that fully closing out the application, like doing a force quit? It won't affect your trip. Yeah, that was a that was an open uh, open multitasking menu. Swipe the app close, and then there's still a persistent notification. Do you want me to force stop it? I can I can try and force stop it. Yeah, let's see. Um, you can try. I wonder if that will. I'm gonna try that. Let's see, I've okay, I force stopped the app here. Are we open? Time here. Three, one, two. South Terrace. Yeah, still getting the same screen after four stop. It's not okay. It's very odd. Okie dokie. And yeah, if there's nothing that can be done about it, that's all right too. I can I can just call another car after. <laughs> Yeah, for sure. I do apologize about the inconvenience there. Not good. Uh, typ typically, in the event that that would happen, if you are having issues uh, with the application itself uh, during a ride like this, if you uh, needed to change your destination uh, because of the issue it's giving you now, what we would do is get our Ro Waymo roadside assistance. Um, but you will, uh, you should be able to rehill once you get to your drop-off destination and try that again. Yeah, sure. Um, but what I'll go ahead and do, just uh, for the inconvenience, is I'll go ahead and waive this trip, so you won't get charged for this, and I'll also add a ten dollar coupon for your next trip. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah. Not a problem. Was there anything else I could do for you? Uh, I believe that's all. Thank you. <laughs> Not a problem, Joel. You have a great rest of your day and enjoy the rest of your trip. Goodbye. Bye bye. I was doing there is that because there's a camera right here I assume he can see through it so I was showing him the app I was like hey here's the screen it's not working <laughs> uh, yeah. shaky uh, yeah screen camera that, that was interesting but
very interesting hesitation in it there. Uh, yeah, I guess the, I wonder if it had to do with the median there with all the, uh, all the plants and trees and whatnot blocking the view of, of that road just in case. Yeah, a nice edge forward, nice and smooth. And once it can see, yeah. And, then, and that's the thing with the, they talked about with occlusion is one of the, one of the big, uh, one of the big problems is with occlusion. So like if something is obscured by another object, like in the cat video they released where the Waymo car uh, slows down for a cat, it started reacting before the, the, the car could see the whole cat. Like when the cat was running out from behind a different car, it still sent the signal to say, hey, slow down for something, you know. But, uh, yeah, so eventually oh, maybe they'll be able to tell with just cameras. Yeah, the volume in this car is really quiet. I might have to subtitle that call. We'll see about that.